what will the swimming pools of the future look like? Of the future. So I think that there's a couple of things that are going to be different about swimming pools in the future. One thing almost for sure is that people are going to abandon chlorine or if not abandon chlorine as the chemical sanitizer of choice to keep the pool clean, they will continue to pursue alternatives until they find a viable alternative. Right now, perhaps AOP or germicidal UV or perhaps some sort of natural swimming pond where the pool is integrated with its natural surroundings and uses some sort of natural filters or biofiltration. And I think that might be more likely what we see in the future for swimming pools. And I think that it's unlikely that we'll continue continue to see this completely sterile chemical environment that we have right now with chlorine based swimming pools. I do like them. I do endorse them because they are safe to swim in. Uh, but surely one day in the future, we will find alternatives to this. Uh, so what else will a pool of the future have? Um, I think something that they'll have is they will have multiple tiers. Right now, we we kind of have just started to master multiple tiers of, you know, one or perhaps two tiers, like, for example, a Vanishing Edge or an Infinity um, Pool, but also one that has an attached hot tub that's on a slightly raised platform. So, boom, right there, we have two tiers already. We have the hot tub into the pool and then the pool over the edge into a surge tank. We might even have a fourth tier because there might be a buried surge tank of some kind but i think one day long in the future swimming pools will have ridiculous amounts of tears like if you're a baller and you've got crazy money why are you not going to have a wedding cake style swimming pool with 10 tiers of cascading water and different swimming pools maybe all at different temperatures because you ball like that um, i don't know if that's how it's going to be but maybe that's what the pools of the future are going to be and i do think that we will see people step up that edge effect to the extreme let's see how extreme we can take it right now we're only doing one or two levels i bet you in the future we do a lot more so what else will we see in the pools of the future i know something that we will most likely see and it's probably starting already it really is starting already swimming pools of the future will not have submerged suction outlets like they do right now Main drains have always been a source of danger in swimming pools due to the entrapment hazard associated with how powerful swimming pool pumps are and the different plumbing conf configurations such that you can make a dangerous environment where a person be can, can become trapped on the main drain. And there's steps which have been taken over time as the industry has evolved to make installations safer. But ultimately, I think one day we will see a move away from submerged suction outlets entirely. The entire filtration suction for your pool will happen entirely through skimmers that happen at the surface level. And the idea is, is that I, I do believe that the modern research shows that you don't need main drains in the bottom of sw swimming pools to facilitate proper filtration of the water. And so why have the risk at all? And that's kind of the idea is just put more surface skimmers in, delete the main drains entirely, and remove the risk and that is something that we're just starting to see emerge in the swimming pool industry i think it is something that we will continue to see and eventually one day long in the future there probably won't be the same dangers that there are associated with swimming pools now like entrapment hazards uh it's better than it used to be but it's not something that's off your plate completely you have to be aware of it because it is a thing and it is a danger if you found this information helpful please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel and you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.